Okay, so much happened this week. Like, so much. Okay, it started off with we went to lower our internet bill and got talked into a bundle that I thought seemed too good to be true. Turns out it was. We're still saving $5 a month and technically have better internet, except when I do a speed test on their servers, it's coming in even slower than the rate I was on before. So we might call them this week. We'll see what happens. We beat the long dart. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> the episodes at least. So now we have to wait for episode five. But for now, we're done all the episodes. <sighs> ah! Run, run. We're gonna try out some survival at some point. I'm not sure when because we started playing Mortal 2 Online. Mortal 2 Online is a lot of fun so far. Super addictive, I would say, but that's just me and MMOs, but I feel like I have a good handle on it. Although I do have it running in the background while I'm supposed to be doing other things and not focusing on things I'm supposed to be doing and instead I'm chopping trees. Where, oh, there he is, there he is. Come here, hammer boy, look at that. Look at it flop. This is what cyberpunk was missing. Mining rocks. Casting spells on myself. Okay, so we got an AFK player. We'll see how it goes. Uh, oh my god, it's coming right for us! We got hit with another storm. Holy sh Searching for greatness in a sea of the dying and shameless, uh, a sea of the aimless. I don't want to be one of the nameless. I'm gonna wake up with the clouds didn't even come for two days. It was ridiculous. And when they did, they piled, I think, four feet of snow into my driveway, four feet high by it was about, I want to say six feet wide. Thanks for that. That was awesome. We beat the Ender Dragon. So that was the first. Get it, get it, get it. We got it. Yeah. We won. We beat the Ender Dragon. It was a great time. It was a lot of fun. That was our Sunday. Played with puppies, obviously. We made a pasta sauce with some meatball. It was delicious. When we went to visit Montreal, we had come back with a jar of my cousin's pasta sauce. I made up half a pot of my pasta sauce and then made the meatballs and added their jar of pasta sauce to it. Reason being because we would the one jar isn't enough pasta sauce to make meatballs in and Pixie really wanted me to make meatballs because I haven't made them in a while. We started playing Tarkov. It was gifted. It's been a lot of fun so far. Problem is trying to find time to play it. It has a lot of really long load times, unfortunately. I did have a thought of what if I played Tarkov and Mortal Online at the same time? That would be kind of cool. The problem with that is they're very, they're both very high demand in games so i don't think my pc could handle it i wanted to start shooting for my fire and ice photo set but couldn't do that mainly because the only snow we really had was super heavy and wet and then it was freezing rain and i'm worried about damaging my camera oh my god we met so many new people this week it was crazy we've met a lot of new people uh, we've got a lot of new people in the discord which is awesome we've got a bunch more people on twitch now Chatting it up. Tons of fun. We're playing games with a lot of new people. That was fun. You guys are in the Discord now, playing games together and talking to each other all the time. That I love. That's been something that I've been wanting for a while, is to have the community be communal. So I'm super thankful for that and super stoked about that. We did our giveaways this week. That was great. We had a bunch of winners. We do them at the end of the month. We gave out a bunch of Steam game keys. It was a good time. I like giving away games whenever I can. We do it last Sunday of every month. Really just go to the Twitch channel and we'll tell you all about it. For the most part, anyone that donates anything is entered at the end of the month for these uh, Steam game key giveaways. And sometimes you don't have to donate anything and you get put into the draw as well. So you have to be there. Come, come, come be there. Come hang out. As she stood in the doorway, I heard a missing bell. What the f does that mean? And I was thinking to myself, this could be heaven or this could be hell. Then she lit up a candle and she 
and she showed me the way. There were voices down the corridor. I thought, I thought I heard them say, "Welcome to the Hotel California." I, I've never read these lyrics. They don't make sense. Such a lovely place, such a lovely face. Plenty of room at the Hotel California. Any time of year. You can find it here. What are you finding? Her mind is Tiffany twisted. What does that mean? She's got the Mercedes Benz. Oh, like Tiffany diamonds. She's got a lot of pretty, pretty boys that she calls friends. And they dance in the courtyard. Sweet summer, sweet, what? Some dance to remember. Some dads to forget! <laughs> so I called up the captain. Please bring me my wine. These guys were on drugs. He said we haven't had that spirit here since 1969. 69, baby! And still those voices are calling from far away. Wake you up in the middle of the night. Just to hear them say Welcome to the Hotel California Such a lovely place Such a lovely face Living it up in the Hotel California What a nice surprise Bring your alibis Time to cancel me now, Eternal. Mirrors on the ceiling? Oh, I've been to those hotels. The pink champagne on ice, they didn't have champagne there. And she said, we are all just prisoners here of our own device. And in the master's chambers, they gather for the feast. They stab it with their steely knives, but they just can't kill the beast. Is that how it's supposed to be sung? I remember I was running for the door. I had to find the passage back to the place I was before. Relax, said the night man. We are programmed to receive. What does that mean? You can check out any time you like, but you can never leave. This song is 